Yes, baby, let's go. It'll work. We can draw the water up with a pump and guide it with the trenches to where we want it to flow. Yeah, fuck yeah. Inventory full, fuck no. Start by placing a pump with the spout pointing in the direction you want the water to flow. Okay. Okay, starting from the spout, connect trenches to the pump. You can connect up to nine trenches to a pump. If you remove trenches from the endpoints, to, ha to have more than nine trenches in a system, you need an extender. Each one will let you add nine additional trenches. Uh, I'm confused. Okay, so it's a three by three. Or a three in between. When you're ready to start watering, activate the pump. The trenches will water the adjacent tiles and the tiles in between two irrigation trenches. The irrigation system needs to be activated daily. You can drain the system if you want to change the layout after pumping. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Oh, no, shit. My inventory is full. Let me go sell some stuff. I'll come back for that. Better not take it. Beat you up. I've been waiting all year for that. Ah, oh, now we get some farming going. I, I really want to test this out. I really want to test this out. So, I can do one right here. Then I've got to do one right here. And then i got to do one right here. But then I would lose this. Ah, uh, I Okay. How to... I guess the top area will be our irrigation. Is, okay. Is that's one, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. Oh, six of those are the trenches. Okay. Okay, gets... Wait, how do I make more of those? Stone and plant fiber? Oh, psh. Say less, fam. Say less. Max. <laughs> Just too excited. I bet that's my gonna be my undoing, but still. Hang on, move your ass. Wait, can I do it? Oh, I can only be placed in the fields. Damn you, mother of... Wait, I think this... Alright, these gotta go. Wait, I gotta think of this... Properly. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta think of this properly. So we have one right here, so that means we're gonna have three. Then one needs to go right here, right? One needs to go right here, and we have another three. Then one needs to go right here. Crap, this is not gonna work then. Why did why can't this be perfectly square? It's gonna work, it's just gonna be ugly. Um I can already tell. I've got. I'm got. I've got to make this a better way. Well, we're only testing it out. Why not? Let's just. I'm pretty sure I could pick it back up anyway. No more trenches. We connected this pump. Why? Bet you can. Okay. Hey, well, I got us a workout. Work my ass on in. things okay well i kind of figured i wouldn't need more of those oh i need two yarn crap i got one yarn i don't have any fur oh you monkey's uncle all right well
let's do it. It's over. Damn it. All right, I guess it's time to test it out, All right? <laughs> awesome. So yeah, I think if I put one on each side, it'll water them all. Alright, well, that changes things. I've got to make a lot of string to make this. Okay. Damn, that's going to take up a lot of space then, isn't it? Hmm, that's interesting. All right, I got to water my plants. Shoot, I forgot about that. Otherwise, I'm not going to have any harvest. All right, all right, all right. I don't think I need to do... Like, crossing this way. I only need to cross it in the beginning and then... But I do need to get more yarn. In which is any yarn should be fine. Okay, so that's said and done. Let's go to sleep. Okay, it's a new day. Um, I think I'm going to focus mostly on um, managing the irrigation or actually trying things out for the irrigation. I want to... Um, I want to make sure I can actually properly do this. Like, if I remove this... Can I actually put it on top of the trench? I can. So that's going to come in handy too. So I'll run the trenches down the middle. So each one's going to have... Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, so we I got a plan. Uh, I might end up d doing something bigger. And I might swap everything from here down to the bottom plot. And then just fence it all out like I did last time. So I might swap things out like animals on top and then and then um, all my stuff here. So there's a lot of work to do. Um, hell a lot of work to do. So I'm gonna need a lot of wool, a lot of trenches. Because I'm trying to make some bank. Yeah, we want to make sure that our stuff is here. And plus, if I go to the cave, I have my farm line right here too. So so let's figure this out um definitely gonna move these guys up here though that's what i'm gonna do move the, these guys up here that's my plan today but first i'm gonna hit the hit up the um i haven't said how to my animals yet i'm gonna hit up the pyramid first so i'm gonna hit the oh, let me hit up let me say how to my animals first and then i'm gonna go hit up the pyramid all right so we still have the animals i'm not gonna put anyone in the um breeder yet because they they're gonna shed uh tomorrow so i'm gonna save their fur because i need the fur to make uh to make the trench extension the, the irrigation extension so i'm gonna need to start collecting a lot of fur and on top of that when i do collect a lot of fur i'm gonna have to keep making more so but i think the bees do also help with trees so i'm gonna also plant them next to the trees all right what do we got Okay, 10. This would be 10. All right, so develop irrigation. All right, cool. So I only need four more to complete it. At least from my understanding. Might be more to it and I don't know about it. What is this? Uh, green thumb ring. Uh, that might be very handy. Uh, what do we got? There it is. Plant growth speed and give the power to make your plants grow faster. Oh, yeah. I will equip that when I need... Actually, you know what? I might as well equip it now because uh, that's what I really want. Harvest yield, plant growth speed. I don't care about the animal friendship. Max stamina is handy, but... Plant growth speed. No. Oh, excuse me. There you go. All right. We're going to stay away from the caves for... For this moment till, till spring because I want to make sure I get my irrigation set properly. Alright. So I guess we're going to start moving things around. Um, damn, all the trees are going to have to be redone too. Well, let's work on that. Um, let's harvest first. So I'll do that real quick. So that's all I could harvest. Um, 
All right, let's turn all this stuff into yarn. I know I probably should this should be a waste, but I need I need the yarn. Kind of sucks. I'm wasting like Gunako fur, but I need it for the trenches, so we're gonna get that done. We gotta clear up some of the land too. So say goodbye to my trees. But we're gonna set up a lot of honey too, so that's another thing. Alright, let's clear out some land first, and then we can move all of our stuff. Yeah, I really need to clear everything out, so I'm gonna spend my day doing that. So I'm just gonna, for you guys that are watching, I'm just gonna fast forward through it, so. Alright, what's the contributions? It is... 647. That's okay. Oh, the great connector. There was another rumbling in the jungle. Could it be? Oh, a water tro. Is it tro or truff? I think it's truff. Could these people have lived with animals like us? Chickens. Do I get chickens? These birds certainly seem to enjoy it here with all this sweet smelling grass. The horse needed something sweet. The horse told him to need something sweet. Then there are these curious the horses. I haven't seen them in these lands. Hopefully, Pachi can give us some clarity. Horses. Okay, I need. I need. I'm gonna have to start saving up to build up a stable. They argued about everything, including the importance of the sea or the reverence for fire. The people divided from getting what bound them together in the first place. They only found more reasons to fight, even arguing over who was born first. They drifted further and further apart, and years passed until all they could remember was their disdain for each other. Tired inside, Pacha shook the earth to show that what could be achieved by working together, and have the sun and moon be one again. A fight of people, not spirits. Yakuans revere water, and Luna is their guide. The Magrani revere fire with Kuro as their guide. It must have something to do with them, but what? I don't know, but I'm gonna get some horses. I guess that's another thing I have to be worrying about, but I'm not gonna... Um, I think I'm just gonna maintain, like, not maintain, I think I'm just gonna do the horse totem, come back and do what I have to do. I don't think I'm gonna actually mess around with the caves much. Oh, back here, okay. Oh. Oh, I bet that's it. Let me go, um, I think I should do that real quick. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Animals can do without me saying hi for a day, right? Should be fine. Alright, so I cleared up a lot of stuff. Let's see how much came back. Okay, nothing. Alright. Uh, go to the horse totem. I'm sh I'm betting that's what it wants, something sweet. And it's the alfalfa. What I say, the tone walks up. Oh, oh, I thought I was gonna get a horse or something. Oh, it opened the way to the savannah. Wait, where am I? Oh. White, is there an all black one? Oh, yeah, okay, I gotta start this. I wonder how much they need. <laughs> that was fun. Three? I could do that.
That's a male white. Female black. Uh... So I guess this is where I get horsies. Is there anything else here? Oh, I'm still technically in the cave. I know there's one more of you here somewhere. I'm gonna get four. Fill up a stable real quick. Get crawl, I'll get crawl and build a stable. Okay, he's got one already. He's got one. Where is the other one? There's one more white one. He requires two. <sighs> it's gonna be a pain though. I mean, I could just get a baby going. I guess there were only three. Okay, well, so I have what? One male. Two males and one female. So I need a, another female. I need another female. Okay, what are you? Male. Female. Okay. Cool. Alright. I still... Uh, I don't have enough to build the actual... Stable for him, so... Um... So I guess... Move the stuff that we need to move now, and then, um... Hopefully my harvests are done so I can get rid of some stuff. Clear out some space. Oh, honey is ready. Yes, okay. Let's, um... A lot of this is ready, which is nice. Alright, let's make sure I don't, didn't miss anything. I think I'm going to donate everything I have. I'm going to keep the winter piece, honey. All right, let's do the fence. Reserve. Why is this reserved? I don't like that. I mean, I guess I could just... See, why is it reserved? That's so annoying. Whatever. Alright, let's get to moving some stuff, which means I have to until this area. You're just going to be in the way, aren't you? Let's get Crawl to move some shit around. Alright, next one is... This is the turkeys. Or ostriches. Is there something there? Oh, you gotta be shitting me, right? Really? Alright, it's getting dark. The goat. Oh, that's all I gotta move, the goats. Oh, it sucks. Wait, I think I messed up. I think I had to put the water inlet. Um, I think I gotta do it like this. Yeah, I gotta do it like this. No more trenches. Um... Crap. So I need to make more of those things. Oh shoot! Time, time, time. Um... I forgot about the time. Hmm. 
I should finish my hammer. All right, you know what? I'm just gonna fast forward. If there's anything that shows up in between, I will show you guys. But for now, I'm just gonna keep maintaining this stuff. Nothing special is gonna happen. I'm just gonna get my stuff ready for spring because I only got three, three more days. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. And then I will go back to you. New Year's Eve. The clan has left early for the festival. Talk to Jack to join the last group before the sunset. Well, that kind of, well, better with age. Ron has an idea for an age, just talk to Ron. Okay, well, shit, I'm not gonna be able to talk to Ron, but I gotta talk to my animals first. I got the horses, uh, I did a lot of cleaning. Also, didn't realize I don't have a lot of room for all the animals. At least in this part of the land. Here we go, Oh. This oh, I got the manure. That's right. Okay, the horse manure. All right, well. Say hi to my animals. I wonder if I can ride them yet. Not yet. Okay. But yeah, I didn't have much room to do everything, which kind of sucks. But I will upgrade some of the stuff before I go to the thing. And I'm doing, I have to do the animals first thing in the morning because of the fact that it gets way too crowded in here. As you can see, there's not much room. <sighs> what can you do, right? And I have no more hay, so I got to spend one whole day just gathering, um, gathering food for them. Need to make some hay. Hay is actually better for them, to be honest. So I'm gonna have to do that. I also did, um, this is what I have so far for my thing. So I know this is kind of offset. So I'm gonna, I wanna keep them all the same. I know it's a waste of items, but with more animals, I can get more, more of the first stuff. So right now I only have this set where I can plant. Actually, I'm, I need to do it by tomorrow, hopefully. That way, water one whole row one whole row and this is gonna go all the way down to i believe all the way down to here to this area so it's gonna have this whole row full of stuff that i can plant so one of them will be the main thing that keeps growing maybe maybe two maybe two two of them will be the main one that keeps growing and then these Actually, yeah, these two will be the ones that keep growing all the time, and the, these last four will be whatever I feel like. So, which means next next year, I have to buy a bunch of stuff. All right, I gotta talk to Ron Ron. But the New Year's festival is here, so I think we should do the New Year's festival first. I don't have any plants. I got rid of all my plants already. So the main thing I have to do is get more food for my animals, finish irrigation, at least get that one road down in the middle. So I need one more extension. And then um, and I can start planning for the next year. So I'm probably spring day two is when I'll get started with everything. But, you know, it's okay. Wanted to get start started day one, but... Who knows? Everyone's at the summit for time special. Are you ready to go? I don't have anything to donate or anything else, so why not? New Year's Eve, your party joined the clan at the festival. Let's make our wishes. Alright, so let's talk to everybody and see what they got to wish for. Do you think Ada's wish has anything to do with me? Not that mine has anything to do with her. Hammer won't tell me what she's wishing for, so I'm not telling him either. Hello, crush. I always wish for more skill, but I never get it. Practice makes perfect. Now I can't really get perfect. Practice makes good. Nook and Tar are such creative books. Festivals are so much fun. I miss the minigame festival. What is that, the competition festival? I miss that festival. I'm wishing for more salt to trade. I love when Eric uses stuff in our food. To think I almost missed Teddy telling one of my favorite stories. Ooh, I wonder what it is. I don't see the point in wishing. It takes hard work to make things happen. 
You know what, Crow? You're right. Keep trying to listen to the story, but Reese is just too beautiful. And it's like, man, I like Crow. You're right. It takes hard work. My wish is that we come here every year. It's just beautiful. So much hard work, like me pouring into this YouTube channel. <laughs> uh, to think even the totems learn lessons. Yeah, man. But doing YouTube is not as easy as I thought it would be. Especially when you edit your own videos. I love this story. And if you're gaming too, so you gotta record, play. I mean, you gotta play and record, and then you gotta edit, which is probably my biggest issue. But, yeah, we'll see. My older sister and I had a tradition of howling when the lights started. I wish I could paint the wolf. Paint this place. Wait, did I just waste my wish? <laughs> I'll get to you last, Teddy. I want to see what everyone's wishing for, though. I'm wishing for prosperity for the clan. Well, I'm doing all the prosperous, prosperous work. You think it's safe up here? Yeah, why mom loves this loves this festival. It's awesome. I'm not sure what to wish for. Maybe that my dad stops trying to tell me what to do. I hear wish to learn a new song, and I did. Hopefully, this year. Wish goes as well. Hmm. Talk to you. <coughs> hmm. I love seeing Oka so happy. This is her favorite festival. I told Mary I was gonna wish to get a pet cave lion. <laughs> I got a pet cave lion. <laughs> I never talk about my wishes. Tar always does a. Tar always does a. Does. Un does a great job putting these festivals together. I don't know what I'd do without her. I have a few wishes. One is that my brother starts acting his age. This festival reminds me of when Zelk and I stayed with the Joe Moten people. They know how to have a party. The spirit of the wolf is as strong with us tonight. I have a feeling he will take extra note of our wish. I should wish for some time to relax, but I think I wish for Pro to stop snowing. <laughs> Oh, why are you here by your own lonesome? I can't wait to watch the lights dance. It's like firefly in the sky. All right, guys, ready for the story of the wolf? Pretty sure this is about a wolf, because, you know, wolf. here we go. Yes, please. A long time ago, when there were more stars in the sky, a little girl named Arena was born without the ability to speak. Every night, she asked her totem for help, but every morning, she was met with deafening silence of her own voice. When it was the night before Darina's rite of passage, she ran away. As she believed no spirit was listening to her silent pleas, Pacha appeared in the stars above Darina. Where are you going, child? Darina looked up at the mother of all, her frustration, anger, and hurt as clear as new eyes. Pacha felt it all. She summoned Wolf, Darina's guardian. Have you ignored this poor girl? Wolf looked offended. Of course not. Look how strong her inner fire is. It was true. Darina's trials had made her resilient, but it also had caused her to feel abandoned. Wanting to make things right, Pacha plucked out her own voice and gave it to Darina. But mother, who protested, but mother, who protested. Pacha only smiled as she was now the one who couldn't speak. Wolf turned his anger to Darina. This is your fault. Darina, for the first time, spoke. It made me think that you weren't listening. Now you dare blame me for your mistakes? Pacha's eyes twinkled with pride. She knew she had made the right decision. Wolf nodded. You have taught me a lesson, young human. I will make this right. And he did. Every New Year's Eve, Wolf transforms our wishes into fires in the night sky. That way we all know who we are heard, whether we have a voice or not. Oh, that's lovely. It's about time to put out the fire and watch the lights. You ready? Let's see this New Year bang. Ouroboros. What was that? Aurora Borealis. What the hell is that Ouroboros? Oh, the Aurora Borealis. Oh, David Borealis. Ha! My stars, you've done well this year. That was lovely. New Year's Eve, a new year begins tomorrow. Time to go back. And it's right, a new year begins. I'm hoping I get some stuff done. Since <sighs> I have a lot to do. Ooh. Hey, 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 hey. Let's 
cook this stuff. Just need one. Just to see what it does. Pretata. Fried eggs. <laughs> okay. Uh, is there anything else I uh, have that I can cook? No, not really. Uh, any vegetable, any egg. Uh, 72 stamina. How many can I, of these can I make? 10? I'll do 5. Just to have some food for my last stamina, so I don't have to keep using the hammock. By the way, which is the only useful thing in this damn game that they made. Complaint to the devs. <laughs> yeah, I don't have any contributions, I know. Spring, we're back to year one. Let's go. 